so next you have a very simple topic which is jfet parameters so jfet parameters there are three different parameters what you have to study here the first one is transconductance next is input resistance the next is ac so drain to source resistance what is is transconductance so what is transconductance so as the name suggests it is a conductance conductance is reciprocal of resistance so conductance it is it is represented as g so we know that resistance is represented as r and so it is inversely proportional to the conductance inversely proportional to the conductance the same thing the conductance you are studying so with respect to jfet so it is a parameter here which we call it as transconductance so which it is called so it is transconductance it is the ratio of change in drain current to change in gate to source voltage change in gate current so when i take the transfer characteristic so this is the transfer characteristic what we explained in the previous section so here you have the transfer characteristic so here we'll take the change in drain current so whatever the current i am getting id the change in the current to the change in the applied gate to source voltage so this ratio from the transfer characteristic is taken and that is termed as transconductance gm is equal to delta id change in the drain current to change in vgs so this is the equation to find the transconductance suppose they ask you to find transconductance of a device in any certain point then you can use this formula gm is equal to gm not into 1 minus vgs divided by vgs of so this parameter is given this will be given and you have to find gm and gm not so what is gm not it is the transconductance or it is the transconductance of the device when vgs is equal to 0 at this point when vgs is equal to 0 what is the transconductance you get that is termed as gm not so this is the transconductance at vgs is equal to zero it can also be calculated as gm not is equal to two times of idss divided by vgs of so mod of vgs of is obviously vgs is a negative value minus 5 minus 4 it may be negative value so mod in the sense you'll be taking the modulus value which is 5 and 4 respectively got it the next parameter is input resistance so input resistance so what is the input resistance of this device it is termed as rn is equal to vgs divided by igss that is it is the ratio of applied voltage which is the applied voltage across gate to source so what is the voltage you apply across gate and source that voltage to the current obtained at gate as gate current igss so it is the gate current what you obtain so this is termed as or this ratio you call it call it as input resistance so input resistance for jfet will be very high so it is also greater than bjt so even it is greater than bipolar junction transistor the third parameter is ac drain to source resistance so when i go for the transfer or drain characteristic so this is the drain characteristic we discussed in the last class so here i'll vary so this is the resistive region what you get so i want to find the resistance at this region so this character or this parameter finds the resistance in this ohmic region so now coming to the equation here so it reflects that so rd is equal to rd da, rds dash is equal to delta vds by id so in this transfer character sorry drain characteristics you can see that in this region you are varying vds and the current is varying here so if i take the change in vds and the change in current the ratio of this will give you the drain to source resistance drain to source resistance so this is the resistance what you get in ohmic region this is the resistance what we get in ohmic region so this is all about the parameters of jfet